Hello! So today's video is going to be the twist top, tube tops, you see a little twist here. Um, fun way to wear your sari wrap skirts. I super love this if they have coordinated layers or if they have mismatched layers because it's like two separate pieces. You have the skirt on the bottom, the top on the top. <laughs> so this is super fun. I have used this style with um, regular skirts, so I'm 5'6". I wear a size two or four regularly. Um, this fits, works well with a regular size skirt. It could work if you size down, um, but you'd have to make sure you just had enough um, overlap in the back, which I'll explain later. So in this one, I have plenty of overlap in the back. So if the wind blows this way, nobody's seeing my honey. I'm not sure I'd be as comfortable if I was doing the junior um, ankle size. But what you can do is use a, um, tealing skirt, so the tassling skirt, it would just make your dress a little bit shorter, um, but would still give you plenty of coverage here. So this um, tube top, twist top tube top, whew, I gotta come up with a better name because that one is kind of hard to say. Um, it's super fun style, and you could wear it on a hot summer day, or you could put like a little shawl over it to um, wear differently. <clears throat> So this skirt, I love this skirt, I just have to show it off. So it's my apple skirt, or one of them. It has this big apple on the bottom, but it has these tiny little apples all throughout the rest of the skirt. So I think that's super cute. <clears throat> um, I am a registered dietitian on my day job. This is my just for fun job, which is not really a job because it's just super fun making these videos for you guys. And I uh, can't wait to be able to wear this skirt when I get back to work and I'm telling everyone to eat their fruits and vegetables and I have it on an apple skirt. So, <clears throat> okay, so for this style, you're gonna take your skirt with your long layer closest to your body, um, like you would wrap it on a normal skirt with a short layer out. You're gonna tie it up high. I don't use the belt loops for this. Um, you potentially could, I guess, if you um, experience some slippage. I haven't needed to do that in this style. And you're just gonna wrap like you would a normal skirt, but up high under your breasts. And then with the ties, I, they're kind of hidden, to be honest, so I just knot it. Um, tight, pretty snug, and then just do a little granny knot there. Nothing fancy, it's not gonna show. Okay, the next step is you're gonna gather the entire top layer. And you really have to get the edge of it. So get under that um, long layer where it's overlapped and pull all the top layer up, all the way around the skirt it needs to be up, okay? Gather this in your hands with the edges, okay? So sometimes when we pull up that short layer, we don't really get the full edge, right? Kind of hangs down. You really want the edge of that skirt to tie up here. And this is where the, the straps kind of get lost here because you don't see them anymore. Pull it up really good and then make sure it's snug like across your back like you don't have some hanging down here you know kind of giving you a funky little bustle back there okay so you want to pull it all the way up and pull it all tight and you're gonna tie a knot or a loop in the front I've got so much layer here I can't figure out how to tie it here okay so you tie your knot up high so make sure it's pulled up all the way in the back and you tie your knot now Technically, some people will just tie this here and actually wear it like this. This is too much like hanging around for me, but if you had like a T-link skirt on and it was a little bit less material, that might work. For this style, I'm gonna be tacky and tie it in a knot because I don't want it to fall down. Okay, so I'm tying a knot here, pretty firm. Um, and this just, you know, all this right here, it's not gonna work for me. So, to make it easier on yourself, Tuck it back down below your um, boobs. Grab the whole skirt and twist until that knot is in the back. And then I kind of have to do a little wiggle jiggle to get the skirt lined out appropriately on the bottom. So now your knot's kind of in the back. And you're going to pull it back up over your breasts. And then fold it like in half. So you have all the material up here. And then you bring it down. You're folding it over. So you have two layers all the way across here. Now, technically, you could just stop here and you could wear this as a nice kind of full coverage tube top. You could totally do that. Um, this is what it looks like in the back. It's got kind of a little, kind of a bustly thing going here, but a, you know, cute one. 
um, and it's full. It's got straight across here. You've got plenty of coverage. This could work on our large busted friends or our small busted friends. Could work for anybody. Okay, and then look how cute, like the little apple just stayed there. Okay, but to twist it, actually, I'm going to stay close. To twist it, you're going to gather the skirt and at the top. So you've gathered it all the way across. This one you're gonna hold. So in one hand, I'm gonna hold it in my right hand. In one hand you're gonna hold, and the other, you're going to flip it under and tuck it below your breast. So tuck all of that that's twisted, keeping that other hand firm, and then pull that back up over your breast. And then the hand you were holding, you actually just pull back down. You let it back down, okay? So it doesn't get tucked. And then you have this nice twist here in the front um, and it kind of it gives you a little shape so for me and my small busted friends we sometimes need a little bit of shape here a little um, maybe design to give it give us like we look like we got a little something there right um, so you have this twist a nice um, across here and just gives it kind of a cute little um, detail and then again you have the full dress look here so it goes you know all the way down Plenty of coverage, plenty of um, movability. I can wiggle around because there's extra material here. It's not going to just fall. It might shift a little bit, but it's not going to just fall anywhere. And then again, the back is just plain. Um, little tie here. This does work best if your top layer is thin um, because you knot it and because it's got this little twist thing happening here. It doesn't work as well with the thick or firmer um, layers, but it's kind of a super fun style. Um, you could add some fun jewelry up here to give it a little something. You could add a cardigan on top if you felt like this wasn't quite enough coverage for you. Lots of options, some cute sandals, and you're ready to go out on a date. Okay. So I hope you enjoyed the twist top tube top. Um, don't forget to click to subscribe. Thank you guys so much for tuning in, and that's a wrap.